Japan is a society that thrives when everyone follows the rules. Don't listen to music too loudly on the train, don't break dance in an elevator. But what happens when you break the rules? What happens when some western cowboy outlaw pulls into town with his horse and desecrates a McDonald's? I love the Shaka Shaka series in Japan. A little powder that you order separately to shake onto your chicken or fries. Recently I tried the Tebosaki Shaka Shaka potatoes, which taste like chicken wings. But instead of being civilized, I decided to see if they were hiding anything from us. What if instead of using the cheese seasoning intended for the chicken, I put the fry seasoning on the chicken? I clutched my visa in my hand knowing very well that this may be the last time I'm able to enjoy my life here in Japan. I even caught an immigration officer peering at me through the window as I sneakily shook my Shaka Shaka. But the immigration officer walked over to me and asked what I was doing. I told him to take a bite and he hesitated because he was on duty, but I patted him on the back for assurance. After one bite he was in tears, saying he has and experienced joy in his life in years since he moved to a new city, and this gives him a reason to carry on. He hugged me and the entire restaurant stood up and clapped. But the real story here is the cheese powder intended for the chicken on the fries. It was delicious. And we all know that McDonald's fries are the best, but this kicks it up 10 notches. Also, the immigration officer bought me an ice cream. That was very nice of him. Thank you.